Hey everybody, I'm Amy from Body Fit by Amy and this is your dumbbell sweat and sculpt workout. So in this workout, we will use a set of dumbbells to both get a good sweat for heart pumping cardio and sculpt and tone those muscles. As always, I will give you lots of different options, so listen to your body and work to your fitness level. All you need for this workout is a set of dumbbells. I will go back and forth between my 10 and eight pound dumbbells today. Are you ready? Let's do it. Okay, so let's start just marching. We'll get a quick little warm up. Roll those shoulders to the back and to the front. We're gonna keep this warm up short and dynamic. So we're just getting the blood flowing, muscles moving, getting some movement prep for the exercises that we're going to be doing. As always, if you need more of a warm up, get it on your own and a cool down as well. But we are gonna get a warm up. Flat back down and round it up. Flat and up. So again, this is sweat and sculpt. Let's hold it here. Roll those shoulders as you gently push out on the inside of the legs. Sweat and sculpt. So every little circuit is going to have a sweat move using the weight. Last one, maybe we'll not use the weight. And then a sculpt move using the weights. Walk them in, round it up, tap out, reach across, stretch it long. So sweat move to get the heart pumping for cardio, sculpt move to really make those muscles burn and strengthen and tone. And then we will get a little break with some core in between. So it should move pretty quickly, should be fun. I hope you like the, di the dynamics between the sweat and the sculpt and then some core. We'll get it done, get a quick little stretch and cool down and then get you out of here, right? So bring those knees up and a little stretch to the front. In between those circuits, I will be previewing your next moves. That's when you can get some water, take a break, keep your feet moving. If you can, little side lunge, step into it, reach it out. Good, all right, so go ahead and shake everything out. Your very first two moves, so breathe, just keep tapping or marching or jogging. You're going to take one dumbbell. I'm gonna grab my eight. Make sure they're out of the way where you're not gonna step on them. We're gonna do for our sweat move, a nice deep squat. Rotational press at the top, knee pull. Deep squat, rotational press, knee pull. You can always do these sweat moves without the weight if that feels better for you. Then, since we got some lower body with that, we're gonna take it down to a push-up row. You can do knees, you can do toes, whatever works best for you. You can even stay in that quadruped, but we're gonna do a strong push-up and then a row each side. With the sculpt move, we'll take it regular and then we'll add some pulses. So get ready for that. All right, 10 seconds to breathe. Then we're jumping in, in that first sweat move, ready. Here we go. So deep, press, pull. Goblet squat, press and rotate, knee comes in. Deep, press and rotate with that core on the pull. Again, modification. You can do everything that we're doing without the weight. Still get low, still rotate, and still bring that knee up high. Here we go. Down, up, down, up, pull. Yes. Hopefully that heart rate's getting up and we're working those legs. Breathe. Get low. Yes. Last one. And relax. Let's take it down. You can probably grab your heavier weight for that sculpt move. I'm gonna stay on my knees for this push-up. Catch your breath, zip up in that core. Again, you can be quadruped with it, with your rows each side, or knees here, or up on the toes. Go ahead and join me here. We're taking it down, row and row. Nice and slow, wherever you are. Strong push-up, use the core, 
and use your chest and shoulders, or even here works too. Down, row, and row. That's good. Slow and controlled, because we're gonna get some pulses in a minute. Use that core as you come out of it. What I mean by that is as you lift out of that push-up, think about pulling the belly button towards the spine, lifting to the ceiling. That's gonna help you engage that core while we get the push with our upper. Last one here, like this. Breathe, breathe, stretch it out. I want you to stay here, watch me here. We're gonna do three pulses on the push-up, row for two. Then we're gonna switch it and pulse with our rows. So you gotta stay with me. Go ahead, find your position after a little stretch. Here we go. Three, two, one, push it up strong. Row and row, keep it going. Three, two, at the bottom, you can do it. Push up strong, use that core. Row and row. You can even do your pulses from here. Three, two, one, push it up. And breathe or push up for your knees and then toes for your rows. Let's get two more. Really burning them out. Breathe up and up. Last one like this. Pulse, 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 strong. Watch me here. Little stretch for your wrist, because I know we're staying down here a long time. Don't worry, we're getting it out of the way in the beginning. Here we go. Pulse it, three, two, one down three two one down push up and up join me pulse that elbow up pulse that elbow up then strong push up all the way through if you're here three two one drop three two one strong push up all the way take it up three two one three two one we're almost done here i know it's long last one right here three two one squeeze three two one breathe stretch it back roll those wrists stretch out those shoulders bring it up we're back to that sweat only for 30 seconds and no weights so after we finish our sculpt, we go back to our sweat, but we keep it quick. Here we go. Down, up, down, up, breathe. You can even do that pull with a little jump. Keep it going. Down, rotate, pull. While we stretch it out. I know that was long with those push-ups. We usually don't stay down there for push-ups that long, right? I knew I was gonna program that in, so I wanted to get it out of the way. Last one, breathe. Yes, shake it out, quick sip of water. Whew. Let's do some core, get a little breather from it. Ha, nice work team. Let's take it all the way down onto our backs. Dumbbells out of the way. Whew. So we're here, ha. let me roll my microphone down onto your back. And let's just take it whew, with that nice, simple dead bug just here, right? I love this move, especially to warm up the core. If you need to modify, you can just do a little march, that works too, or here. If you wanna take it out, breathe and breathe take it out deep core we'll check down with your core make sure everything is pulling in not pointing up you're really pulling in if you want to lift the shoulders a little bit more to get a little more upper core you can take it eight seven six five four three two one relax hug those knees and bring it back up we're into our second circuit if you want to just grab those knees 
while I explain our next two moves to keep the cardio going, go for it. All right, so we're taking it. Little shuffle with a push. Shuffle, 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 push. Shuffle, 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 push. So you're going to the side. You can make it a double step or quick shuffle, push out, push in. Think out, but try not to let it pull you forward. Your move for sculpting. We're gonna take it in a side lunge and we're gonna curl it at the top. Deep, we'll go right, we'll go left, then we'll isolate on our sides. All right, grab your dumbbells, catch your breath, here we go. Shuffle, 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 push. Keep it in the center. So think about those muscles we were just working, chest and shoulders and back. Push in, push out, squeeze in the back. Again, low impact, you're just doing a nice big double step. Use the space you have. So if that's smaller, shuffle, 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 or bigger, up to you. Yes, 10 seconds. Breathe. Keep it going. Here's your sweat. Three, two, one. Relax. Grab your other dumbbell. I'm gonna stick with these eights. We're gonna alternate side to side. Then when we get to those pulses, we're gonna stay on one side. Watch me. Here we go. Deep squat. Curl it up. Side lunge. Lateral lunge. Get low. Curl at the top. Super controlled. Breathe. Drop it down. Push it up and in. Get low. Get high. Watch my back. I'm staying flat. Even as my chest goes forward, I'm not going here. I'm keeping it up. And breathe. For four. And up. Three. Two. Last one. Watch me here. I'm gonna pulse for three. Three, two, one. Stay on the same side. Curl. Three, two, one. And curl. There we go. Three, two, one. And up. Yes. Three, two, one. Watch me here. Take it down. Pulse with those biceps. Three, two, one. And up. Stay low. Three, two, one. Let me show you what that looks like. Out in front. Three, two, one. And up. Three, two, one. Other side with the legs. Here we go. Three, two. Let's take a hammer curl. Palms in. Three, two, one. Palms in. Yes. Three, two, one. Good. Keep it going. And then pulse that bicep. Low. Three, two, one. All the way up. Three, two, one. And up. Two more. You're going to feel a little pull. Core is working hard. Last one. And up. Good. Dumbbells out of the way. No weights. Back to that sweat. Shuffle. Push. Yes. 30 seconds. Make it good. We're going to grab some water. Then we're going to take it down for some core. Yes. Breathe. You got it. 10 to go. Can you get a little quicker? Keep those feet moving safely. Whatever works for you. Three, two, and one. Grab some water. Yes. Woo. Catch your breath, team. Okay. Into that plank position. Let's go on our elbows. We're gonna take it here. We're here. So elbows, if you need to stay on your knees, just tap it back and tap it back. If you can, we're gonna take it here. We're gonna walk it up. Three, two, one. Dolphin, three, two, one. Walk it in, up, up. Lift through that core, stretch the back. Up, up, up. If you wanna take it, up, 
and back. Keep it slow. We're not going too fast because I want you to still pull in the core. Lift and down. Keep going. Lift up in the center. Either way, that pull, that belly button we talked about coming out of the push-up. Lift with that deep core, whether you're walking it up, whether you're jumping it up. Keep it going. Four more here. Four. And back, nice and light. Three. Two. Last one. Breathe, good. Bring it up onto your feet. All right, you can go back to that shuffle if you want, right? Second circuit didn't feel quite as long as that first one. I told you we were getting it out of the way. All right, so with your dumbbells, let's take either, let's take one heavy one, so whatever you get. We're gonna do a swing into a pop-up. So you have a couple of options. Think of your kettlebell swing. You're swinging it back. We're gonna go three times. Three, two, one. Drop it down, pop it back, pop it up, get in place. Three, two, one. Drop it down. So you gotta stop the swing and then pick it back up. Power into it, okay? It's not a squat, it's a swing. Pop up is optional. If you wanna take that pop up out of it, just keep the swing. Your second move, one heavy dumbbell. Reverse lunge, lunge, twist, press. We're gonna go all in one side and then all in the other. Through those pulses, you can do it. All right, ready for that sweat. Here we go. Swing it, chest up. Prep it, then power it up. Here we go. Two, one. Let it swing and relax. Pop it back, pop it in, set up. Three, two, one. Swing and relax, pop it back, pop it in. If you want, just keep that swing. You can keep it going, you can get some breaks in between, because it's gonna be long. Or walk it back, that works too. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let it drop, walk it back, walk it in. Set it up. Up. Yes, going a little bit longer because this is a two-parter. Back and up, one more. Let it drop, pop it back, pop it up. Yes, breathe, relax. Grab that one dumbbell. Reverse lunge. You're gonna hold it center. We're gonna step it back, get low, twist over the knee that's in the front, Press it up strong. Core's in tight. If you wanna take the twist out of it and just do the push, that's okay too. Here we go, lunge it. Lunge, twist, push out, and press. You can also keep it stationary. If you don't wanna step into it, and up. Or here, twist, and up. Yes! There we go. Let's go four more, make it good. Four, three, two, last one. Watch me here, stay low. Pulse three, two, one, press, get low. No twist, two, one, low as you can go. Yes. Two more right here. And up, last one. Hold it here, watch me get low. Pulse, twist, twist, step out of it. Three, two, too much balance or you don't wanna twist, just get low again. Do what you just did with the legs. Two more, yes. Lots of work in that front leg not just for strength, last one, relax. But that front leg has all the control to keep your balance too. How's that heart rate, right? Woo. I know, I'm feeling it too. Catch your breath, get ready for that other side. Sometimes the sculpt gets your heart pumping more than that sweat, right? All right, so starting center, keep it stationary if you need to, step into it if you can, lunge, twist, 
and press. Here we go. All the way up. And up. Keep it going. And up. Get low in that lunge. Again, if you need to keep it stationary, this works too. Down, twist, and up. Four more. Four, and up. Three, two, yes, one more. Hold it here, pulse for three. Three, two, one, and up. Three, two, I want you to really drop that knee. Three, two, one, push out of that front heel. Lots of control, no twisting yet. Last one. Good, take it low. Twist, three, two, one, step and push. Three, two, small little turn in that torso. You don't have to go very far to get those obliques. Good, two more. Last one. And relax. Oh man, you guys, dumbbell out of the way. Back to that sweat. We're just gonna do the pop-up. I know everything's burning. I know that heart rate's up. But if you can, modification, just take it here and up. But if you can, down, back, in, and up. I know it looks like a burpee, but I want you to take it slow. You don't have to jump at the top. Join me, keep going. We're going only 30 seconds. Push for heart rate. Then we're back down with that core. We're so close, guys. Down. And up. And up. 10 seconds. Sweat. Hand sculpt. Five, four, three, two, one. You did it. Quick sip of water. Oh man, how are we doing, people? My <laughs> heart is pumping. And I'm feeling those muscles. How about you? <coughs> oh, goodness, right? Whew. Breathe into it. All right, here is our sweat. Let's take it down. All right, guys, how are those legs feeling, right? So you, huh, oh no, let's get some core first, right? How about some core Whoo, on your back? Since those legs are really feeling it, here's what we wanna do, guys. We're gonna get the scissors. Three, two, one, reach. Three, two, one, join me. Modification, you can just Lift and lower without that crunch, but if you can, three, two, one, big reach. Three, two, one, and reach. Make sure you switch those legs. Reach. Keep it controlled, even though we're counting and we're going quickly. What I mean by that is not swinging those legs. Really control it. Really control on that lift. Deep core in. Breathe. Ha. Where are, here we go, let's go four more. Pulse, pulse, and crunch. Scissors. Check in with that core as you get tired. Pull everything in. Yes, relax, ha. Good work, team. Woo. Breathe, yes, all right. Stand up into it. All right, your last sweat is up top. And then we'll take it down with that sculpt. Breathe, or your last standing sweat, we should say. One dumbbell in the center. I want you to step out into that transverse. All the way down, all the way up, side knee, center. All the way down, all the way up, side knee, center. You can do the same without the weights. Just like our first squat rotational, 
I want you to think obliques. Get low for legs, high for arms, and then squeeze for abs, right? Get it all in. Whew. All right, let's finish it out. And then we're gonna take it down on our back with a little bit of hamstrings, glutes, core, and arms. Ha! Everything, right? But I will tell you when we get there. So don't worry about your sculpt just yet. Let's get this over with so we can take everything else down to the mat. Here we go. Transverse, open, up, shh. Open, up, shh. Down, and up, shh. Good, remember, you can do everything without the weights. Low, step it in. If it bothers your knees to be turning into that diagonal, just take it to the side. Low, breathe. Low, you can just do step out into a side plie without the transverse. Good, keep it going. Up. Yes. There we go. Five seconds, one more each way. Yes, relax, good. Come down on your back with those dumbbells. Let's take it here, finish it out strong. Ha, ah, breathe. So go ahead, come on your back, catch your breath. After all of that, we're gonna take it straight up in a bridge and then some tries. Watch me here, elbows in, knees in, here we go. Up, tries, crunch, everything down. Up, tries, crunch. If that bothers your back or your head and neck or you need to modify, I want you to just do the bridge press and try. So you can keep it here, up, tries, and down. But if you can, everything in, up. It requires that little reset, right? Reset here, up, tries, crunch, reset, up, tries, crunch. Two more, up, tries, last one, keep it going, up, tries, crunch. Here we go, take it here, up in that bridge, three, two, one, everything down. Pulse three, two, one, everything down. If this is starting to feel like too much for one or the other, just do one. Stay safe with those dumbbells, especially over your head. Three, two, one, last one. Good, take it down here. Bring those feet up, pulse and your tries. You can do it, three, two, one, crunch. Three, two, one, crunch. Feels like too much, you can always switch to one. Three, two, one, everything in. Yes, triceps. Two more, breathe. Crunch, last one, three, two, one. Yes, oh, back of the arms right, little bit of hamstrings, little bit of core. Bring it up, stretch, back to that sweat. I know, no weights, here we go. Transverse, breathe. Can you get a little quicker? Transverse, step in, here. If you wanna add a little jump. Here, or here, just step it. Remember, if that turn is too much to your knees, plie, plie. Turn if you can. Yes, four, three, two, last one. Relax, grab a quick sip of water, guys. Let's bring it down for good. We are so close to being done. I know you love it when I say that. Whew. Core, with a little bit of sculpt, right? 
So take it here, even though our last sculpt had some core. Side plank, start on that knee, bring it up, here we go. Squeeze and in. You can do a little rotation with your knees and your hips or all the way up. We're only going for 10 on your knees or on those feet with or without the weight. Ready, here we go. Here, turn in if you want. Turn in if you want, or just here, take it down. You can even take the rotation out of it. We're working the obliques, we're getting back. No weight is fine too. We're all the way up. And breathe. Two more. Last one. Relax, good. Stretch that over, ha. Whew. Take it over here. Start on those knees, no weight if you want, or with the weight, knees or toes, only 10. Here we go. Bring it up and down, or up. Rotate into it. And breathe, or here. That works too, with or without the rotation. Breathe. Yes. Two more. Last one. Relax. Bring them in. Stretch it out. Woo. All right, guys. Can we do it? I think we can. One last sweat from the ground. One last sculpt. Watch me here. It's going to get core, both of them. All right? So we can do it. I want you to come up into that high plank. We're going to... Take that little jump that we did with the pike, but we're gonna jump it to the side. So watch me here. Jump in, jump out, jump center. Knees out, out, center. Or walk them in, walk them out diagonal, walk them to the center. Walk them in, walk them out, and center. If you need to stay on those knees, you can just do a little bird dog, or you can just walk them back, just like this. Join me here. It's your last sweat. We're only gonna do it once. Get that core, get that cardio. Whew. Give your wrists a little run. I know they've been working hard, but let's finish it out. Ready, here we go. Diagonal, center. Diagonal, center. Or walk it up to that knee and back and center. Up, opposite knee and back, center. Center, center, strong in your arms. I know they're getting tired. Take a little stretch break if you need to, or take the jump out of it and low impact. Here we go. Walk it, back, center. Walk it, back, center. Finish it out, 10 seconds. Breathe. Yes, last one. Here, good, relax, I know, Woo. Ha. good work team. All right, catch your breath, here we go. Let's take it for some sculpt. One dumbbell, it's a pullover, one leg, we're here. Lift up, take it down, bridge, take it down, crunch, and bridge. If you need to modify, I want you to just keep the bridge, take the crunch out of it. But if you can, crunch it up, bridge it up. Here we go. Crunch, bridge, crunch. Lots of hamstrings and glutes, arms and upper back and core. Breathe. Good, two more. Lift, last one. Good, pulse it up. Pulse in that crunch. Four, three, two, take it low. Small little movements. Four, three, two, pulse in that bridge. Yes, finish it out. Four, three, two, relax. Stretch out that leg. 
I know that hamstring's feeling it. We're gonna get all of that on the other side. It's very isolated, very precise. Heart rate, hopefully, is coming down. Here we go. Take it over and crunch. Bridge over and crunch. Remember, modification, just do the bridge. And up, lift all the way down. Feel that pull in your core and worked against it. We're here, pull that belly button in, then really tight. And breathe. Three. And breathe. Two. As it goes down, deep core. Last one. And breathe. Crunch it up right here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Pulse it over, really small, really low. Deep core, four, three, two. Hamstring, lift it up, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Relax. Ah, you did it, I know. Bring it here, get a little stretch. Ha, ah, ha, ah, not so bad to end on that, right? A Little bit of a burn, Ooh. stretch that out how do you feel Ooh. so grab here if you can flex and point that toe to stretch out through that hamstring so there you go guys sweat and sculpt a little bit of heart rate with the sweat but then again a lot of our sculpts got that heart pumping too right breathe cross that over if you liked this format had a live workout a couple weeks ago that is sweat and sculpt with weights. You can use dumbbell or kettlebell that's similar and I'll be making more, so make sure you check that out. And of course, check out all of my other dumbbell videos and all the other playlists. You can find no equipment, uh, kettlebell, TRX, bands, balls, prenatal, postnatal. Whew. Bring it up, take those knees out, stretch to the side. So many different options. If you want to find tons of more, hundreds actually, completely free videos, stretch it out over here. And of course, if you are looking for more structure or more of a schedule or a routine to go along with these videos, make sure you check the links in the description right below here. You will find information on my eBooks and my programs. Let's roll through that wrist and drop that shoulder. Ebooks and programs are just curated schedules that go along with the YouTube videos. You can find three days a week, five days a week. You can find them for different types of equipment, different lengths, different goals. So check those out. And also don't forget to check out my nutrition guide. There's also a link right here. Not a diet plan. It is just a structured plan with flexible options. So no counting calories or macros, no restrictions, nothing like that. Nothing is off limits. We just teach you how to build a balanced plate and to fill your plate with lots of nutritious and delicious. I know it sounds cliche, but it's true. Stretch that over. Good. Whew. Reach those thumbs to the back. Open up your chest. Grab if you can. And of course, guys, if you liked this video, please make sure that you hit that subscribe button. When you subscribe, that helps me to keep making completely free videos here for you on the YouTube channel. So hit subscribe, make sure you share the videos, let people know. And then once you subscribe, if you turn on that little notifications button, you will make sure that you get information on when I release something new and when I do live workouts, and let me know below what you thought, of course. Whew. All right, guys, rolling back and to the front. Thank you for showing up today. One big deep breath in. You did it. That was your dumbbell sweat and sculpt workout. Great job, everybody.